Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing a full day vegetarian meal plan which is also a thyroid friendly diet plan. This meal plan will help you to lose 7 to 10 kilos in just 10 days. I have customized this diet plan to suit Indian taste and I'm using easily available and inexpensive ingredients. This is a completely sugar free diet and that means no refined sugar for 10 days. You can have coffee or tea if you prefer but without added sugar and not more than 1 to 2 cups a day. This diet plan has the required nutrients and can even be continued after 10 days. I have divided this meal plan into 3 main meals and 2 small meals and hence you will not feel hungry throughout the day. I am using only the required amount of natural fat and that means no refined oil for 10 days other than the natural fats I am using in this diet plan. This plan will give you the desired results only if you don't cheat for 10 days. Take this diet plan as a challenge to wean off from refined sugar, oil and processed food. So let's get started. Start your day with lemon and honey water. Into a glass pour in warm water, squeeze in half a lemon and add in 1 tablespoon honey and stir well. Have this on an empty stomach. This drink will help to accelerate your metabolic rate throughout the day. And for those who are having my turmeric tea or apple cider vinegar drink can continue it. Please check the description box below for ingredients list and also for the links mentioned in the video. Light to moderate exercise is needed for a successful weight loss plan. So try to go for a 30 minute walk or do light yoga. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. It is the one meal that fuels you throughout the day. So do not skip breakfast. Also note that breakfast should be had after 30 to 40 minutes of the morning detox drink. I am serving a bowl of sliced banana and some fresh pomegranate seeds. Banana is packed with nutrients and it is rich in potassium, vitamin B6 and has low to medium glycemic index. The fiber and the low glycemic index of the banana ensures that blood sugar rises in a slow and steady rate. Banana is an essential fruit for thyroid health. Pomegranate seeds contain different types of antioxidants and bioactive polyphenols that promote cardiovascular health including healthy blood pressure levels. The vitamins and minerals present in fruits helps the thyroid gland to function well and produce more thyroid hormone. So I highly recommend you to include fresh fruits in your diet especially seasonal fruits of the place you live in. Hence this bowl of banana and pomegranate seeds will not only nourish your thyroid but also will keep you fuller till your next meal. Also make sure that you keep yourself hydrated by drinking plenty of water. You can also have my fat cutter drink and make sure you drink at least 8 to 10 glasses of water. Have a bowl of thick homemade curd or yogurt as a mid-morning snack. Now into a bowl add in fresh homemade curd, add in some moringa leaves. You can also use chopped coriander leaves, curry leaves or mint leaves instead. And for a crunch sprinkle some pomegranate seeds and remember no salt should be added to this. Lunch is a wholesome and filling meal with roti, sweet potatoes, green chutney and a drizzle of curd or yogurt. This is a filling and nutrient dense meal with green chutney and, and sweet potatoes. I had already shared the recipe so please do check it out. Links will be down below in the description box. Have a handful of dry fruits as an evening snack. You can have a handful of any dried fruit or a mix of 2 to 3 dried fruits. If having dates, remember to limit to 2 or 3. Now if you have thyroid issues, don't have peanuts in this meal as you'll be having them in your next meal. Also remember that a small handful is what you're allowed to have. So do not overindulge on dry fruits. Along with this you can have your favorite green tea, lemon tea or even your favorite infused water. Dinner should be had by 7 pm. If you are commuting at this time 
प्लीज प्लान अहेड एंड पैक योर डिनर फॉर डिनर इट्स अ बाउल ऑफ ट्रेडिशनल इंडियन मील विद पोहा विच इज ऑल्सो नोन एज अवल इन मलयालम पोहा ऑफ फ्लैट एंड राइस विच इज ऑल्सो नोन एज अवल इन मलयालम इज लाइट ऑन द स्टमक कीप्स यू फुल ऑफ फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम इजी टू डाइजेस्ट इट इज कम्प्लीटली ग्लूटन फ्री एंड इट्स अ गुड सोर्स ऑफ इंस्टेंट एनर्जी इट ऑल्सो प्रोवाइड्स वाइटामिन बी वन along with zinc iron and magnesium if you are anemic or has thyroid issues poha should definitely be in your diet now to make the upma first you need to soak the poha or avel and for that i have added 1 cup of poha into a strainer i'm using red or brown avel or poha you can use any type you can get at the place you live in red or white does not matter and in this recipe i'm using the thicker hand pound variety now pour some water over it and lightly rinse allow it to keep it on the strainer so that the excess water is drained while you prepare the rest of the ingredients to make poha upma heat a pan or a kadai add in 1/4 cup of peanuts and lightly roast it on medium to low flame peanuts are a rich source of plant protein fiber nutrients and healthy fat dry roast them on medium flame and once the peanuts are roasted remove them to a plate and keep aside Now add in 1 tablespoon of coconut oil into the same pan and once the oil is heated add in 1/2 teaspoon mustard seeds and 1/3 teaspoon of fenugreek seeds once it starts to splutter add in 1 whole red chili 1 sprig of curry leaves 1 chopped onion 2 chopped green chilies and allow this to saute on low flame until the onions are lightly transparent once the onions are transparent add in 1/2 teaspoon turmeric powder and mix well then add in 1 grated carrot and 1/4 of a chopped capsicum you can add any vegetables of your choice any seasonal vegetable would work well add in 1/2 teaspoon pink himalayan salt and cover and let it cook for about 2 minutes The moisture on the lid will help to cook and lightly wet the vegetables. So after about 2 minutes open the lid and mix well and add in the soaked poha and crumble with your hands. Mix it well for about 1 minute and then add in the roasted peanuts. Squeeze in half of a lemon mix well and switch off the flame. Healthy and easy poha upma is ready to serve. Do try this meal plan and share your results with me. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button to stay updated with new videos. Thank you for watching and until next time, take care. Bye-bye.